Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Sukoden, brought to you by GameAnyone.com, and Miss O'Neill here still says the same thing, yes. Okay. Well, let's see what's going on. It looks like Maz has made himself comfortable. A fine collection of tools you have here. Well, they're not mine, but whatever. Yeah, we don't really need to do anything here, so whatever. Um, looks like Antonio's here. I shall cook something that will give everyone power. I'm fighting too. Okay, I don't know where he's cooking in there, but whatever. I don't know where I'm going, apparently. Let's go up here. Let's go talk to Mr. Kai, shall we? We need to put him in our party before we head back to Kuin. And, uh, oh, all right, I guess we can take a bath. What's happening? Want to take a bath? You'll feel refreshed. Okay. I guess we can take a bath real quick. This is how the bath works. Basically, if you come here with certain people in your party, you'll have little, like, scenes, conversations. Those are the bath scenes, but I'll be showing them off. Probably once I have all the characters, but you can place antiques here. That's ba This is basically what antiques are for. Yeah, you can put them, uh, like that. Anywhere you want, really, like that. So that's basically what antiques are for. In later suit codes, you can actually put them, uh, in more places than the bath, but this one, it's just a bath. Hey, how about a practice match? Um, don't have time for that kind of stuff. Cause we gotta get going, but let's put Kai in our party. Take out Taiho. There you go. Good times will be had. There he is. Okay, cool. He's got the hazy rune on, which is cool. And, uh, we're gonna put him in the front row. There we go. Okay, he's got Conjurer Staff, level 8, and he's in level 21, which is pretty nice. He's got some decent equipment, but we could stop by Kaku and give him, a, give him two pairs of shoulder pads. Might as well. Might as well. And then it's off to Kuin. So we gotta find out about this Lapot guy, but first we should stay at the inn. What the hell? Just got caught between two beds, man. What the hell's going on with that? Jeez. Come on now. It's ridiculous. Oh, uh, well. Let's be on our way, shall we? See what's going on. Get in the boat and head back to Kaku. Okay. Oh, really? We're gonna play this crap again? Seriously? I'll just leave and come back. That's usually the best thing to do when that happens. God, I hate that. Seriously? Come on. What the hell? Uh, whatever. It's, um, a pointed hat. I, I guess that's better. Okay, cool. Shoulder pad, then he doesn't need any better armor from here. Because he's got karate uniform, it's better than the uh, guard robe. So, yeah. There you go, Mr. Kai. Have some shoulder pads, have some protection for your shoulders. Definitely a good thing. Okay. So let's head south to Kuin. Bum, 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 bum. Yay, a rock, whatever. Take him down real quick. Doing Miss Injector. There you go, Kai. Make short work of him. <laughs> yeah, I'm probably gonna have Kai in my party for quite a while. More than likely. It's not a bad idea either, let me tell ya. Kuin. Alright. This here village of Kuin survives thanks to Master Lapont. Yet that new military commander... Who do you think the new military commander is? Well, it's somebody that you're probably not gonna like. I know I don't. But we'll find out about that later. Lately, Master Lapont has been keeping to himself and refuses to see anyone. Well, that's not good. If you cross the Imperials, there's no telling what they'll do. That new commander seems pretty mean, too. Oh boy, who do you think it could be? Oh man, could it be somebody we know? I don't know, man. Oh. Hey, look, it's Kryn. What's he doing here? 
going to La Ponce Mansion? <laughs> Forget it. You're wasting your time. I won't stop you from going, of course. So go ahead. I have a better idea, though. <laughs> okay. There's Lorelai. She's awesome. Who are you? Hmm, the Liberation Army, eh? You can try to recruit her, but it's not going to do any good. Gee, I don't know. Um, forget it. I don't hang around with weaklings. She won't join you until Tears in level 25, by the way. And she actually appears in multiple Sukodans. She actually appears in Sukodan 2, and again in Sukodan 5. Just for a little uh, information for you. <laughs> And I'm actually a big fan of her. She's a pretty good character, in my opinion. But here we have the armor shop, and there's some upgraded stuff here. It's going to cost a lot of money, but you know what? That's what money's for. So let's go for it. Buy leather armors. You know, and it's actually a good thing that nobody can equip a shield, because that steel shield is really expensive. So, yeah. So equip leather armor on anybody that can have it because that's a really good upgrade. And you're going to be glad you did, because the enemies we're going to be fighting here are... Uh, they can be pretty rough, actually. So... Yeah, so, um... Even though it, it does cost a lot of money, I would recommend upgrading your equipment here, definitely. Or at least getting whatever you can get. If you want to go and grind, that's cool. There we go. Do good stuff. Awesome. There we go. Getting some good defense now. <laughs> yeah. And then let's uh, sell off all that crap real quick. I think they got some good accessories here. I think they got the uh, emblem, which I believe raises your magic. So that's pretty cool. Let's see here. And the blue ribbon, yeah. But sadly, uh, Camille can't have the emblem for some reason. And Cleo... Cleo actually doesn't need it, but she... But Camille can't have the blue ribbon, so that's cool. But yeah, emblems do increase your magic, which is pretty nice. Pretty nice stuff. So I would recommend getting two of them for everyone that can have them. If you can afford that. If not, well, it's not that big of a deal, really. Basically, just get whatever you can afford. And if you want to go grind for er everything, you can go right ahead. But I don't think I'm going to need to. Ah, crap. I need one more for Kai, but... I got stuff to sell, so it's not a big deal. Unfortunately, Cleo still does not need anything over those wing boots. Like I said, she's going to have those for quite a while, so get used to them. There we go. Get that last one for Kai there. And we'll be good to go. Hell yeah, man. Do -do -do -do. Uh, excuse me. There you go. All right, now, that's, now that the shopping's out of the way, we can see what else is going on around here. Don't go in there. The commander will be furious. Well, I guess we can't even go in there. There's an appraiser. I guess we can get that stu stuff that they've been dropping appraised. Real quick. If there's anything good, it's probably a hex doll. Yep. And I guess the other one's a hex doll, too. I don't think you can sell... I think you can sell hex dolls for, like, what, 60? Something like that. Not a whole lot, but... Yeah. But might as well sell it, you know? No, no sense in having two of them. But, yeah. Alright, so let's go to LaPont's mansion. Here's Giovanni. I'm sorry, but my master LaPont is very busy and cannot see you. When will he be free? I don't know. Tomorrow, perhaps, or the day after, or in a month, or even a year. What? Sounds like one busy guy. Jeez, the hell? 
I don't know, man. I guess we better talk to Kryn. You went to LaPont's mansion. He <laughs> You guys would never get in, even if you spent years in front of his house. I have a much better plan. Care to hear me out? You'll get to meet LaPont. Okay, uh, tell me what you have in mind, I guess. Good, but this is not the place. Let's go to the inn. You know, just a few steps away. Whatever. Let's hear what you have to say. Don't rush me now. Do you know why LaPont won't see anyone? Why? He doesn't want to get involved with guys like you to fight the Empire. That's why he refuses visitors. But why? That's not like what Matthew told us about him. I don't know anything about that. Anyway, let's get down to details. Laplante treasures two things above all else. One is his wife Aileen. The other is the great sword Kurenji. So... So if you steal Kurenji, Laplante will most certainly come after you. Then, after you face him, you can talk to him, or blackmail him, or whatever you like. Understand? I see. So how do we steal Karinji? <laughs> Just leave that to me. Wait here a while, and then come on over to LaPont's house. I'll see you later. <laughs> God, that guy's weird. Are we pretending to be thieves now? How pathetic. Who's pretending? We are thieves. Well, it's not really honorable, but you know what? Sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. It's about time we got going. I guess so. I mean, the owls are hooting, so we better get going. Ba -ba 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 -bum. Here you are. Wait just a moment. Okay. There, now you can go in. Aren't you coming? My job is done. Now it's your turn. I'll be waiting here. Okay. So let's do this. So this place is basically like a dungeon. A, a mini dungeon. It's not that long, really. There's a chest there. Make sure you pick that up. Shoulder pads. Yay. But there's two kinds of enemies in this place. <laughs> And there's some guy here. Rock. Hi there. Me, as you see, I'm just a warehouse guard. Are you people from the Liberation Army? I see. Mind if I ask you something? Is the Liberation Army's vault big? What? You don't have one yet, but do you plan to build a big one? I see. I see. Master Tear, I was hoping to join the Liberation Army for quite some time. Please let me join. Yeah, man, why not? We need a vault. So, thank you so much. L let's go and b build a b big one. And Rock joins. That's cool. It's a pretty easy recruit. Medicine, okay. And here's Slot, man. He's, he's, really, he's, he's really not that hard. I mean, you usually end up killing him before he even gets a turn, so... <laughs> yeah. No big deal there. Do Alrighty then. Got, got a question mark pot. It's pretty cool. 700 bits. Nice. And here, basically you gotta sneak around these dolls, because if you get in front of one of them, you can't do a battle. You have to start over and crap. Freaking thing. Freaking wall like pushed me. Yeah, but basically there's... Yeah, there's the... The, the robot soldiers with the spear and the ones with the sword. They're really, they're really not much of a difference, but they can be pretty rough. But here's the Unite attack. Very awesome attacks. All enemies for good damage. Like I said, it's probably one of the best Unite attacks in the entire game. So, yeah. It's very useful here. Very useful. Well, that's why I, I recommended going back and getting Kai before you came here. So it makes these enemies a lot easier to deal with, you know what I'm saying? 
fight here. Fights here give pretty decent experience. And now we gotta start over. We'll basically do, do the same thing I just did, just don't screw it up. And you're good to go. Make sure you come down here and grab this chest. The counter crystal, cool. And more robot soldiers, awesome. Do a little master pupil attack. Clone rune, you know, whatever. Uh, no, not the water rune. I keep forgetting I don't have the fire rune on here. Dancing, yeah, we have dancing flames now. I'll show that off eventually. I was gonna do a little of that, there you go. No fire, it doesn't seem to work very well on these guys, but oh well. Look at that, that is just awesome. Seriously. Oh yeah, these guys can do some damage, especially when there's a group of them. They can do some serious damage. Which is why I recommended upgrading your equipment. There you go, Kai. Yes, Kai is awesome. And that's just the way it is. Yeah. Dude. At least on the way out of here, you don't have to worry about these these robots. Because they kind of get shut down, which is pretty cool. Once we recruit a certain character who's coming up. Got a speed rune piece. We can go ahead and use that on tier. Why not? There you go. Alrighty then. Come on down this way. And, um, bum, 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 bum. We got some more treasure in here. Leather armor. Cool, we can hold on to that or sell it. Either way. Fire rune piece, that's cool. Kinda wanna put that on Cleo or Camille. Medicine. And another chest here. White paint, make sure you hang on to that. That'll be important later on. Material for mural, yeah. Who's this guy? This is Jupo. My god, you scared me. Who are you? Fellow thieves? How do you do? Who are you? Me? I'm Jupo, the trickster. Who are you? Trickster? Did you make this contraption, which we haven't seen yet? That's right, that's right. Do you like it? You must be kidding. Hey you, turn that infernal contraption off right now. Yeah. Hmm, that may be difficult. The dolls I can shut off, but the big one, impossible. So enjoy it, soldiers of the Liberation Army. Yeah, it doesn't say it, but he actually joins you right there, by the way. But yeah, the big one is in here, and this thing is really annoying. Not this thing. This, this thing is just kind of weak, but yeah. But the big one is in this room, and it's really annoying. It can be very time-consuming. It can also be pretty quick. It, it just depends on your luck, I guess. It's like a little... It's kind of a mini-game kind of thing. Basically, you come up on this thing, and it randomly stops somewhere, depending on what you stop, different things happen. Like, that's monster. Well, we'll, we'll have to fight some of those robot doll things. But the little chest gives you medicine. Plus 10 experience, minus 10 experience, obviously. Which, which 10 experience is like nothing, so not really a big deal. And then there's also a question mark, which gives you the uh, dragon seal incense. But in order to advance, you actually have to uh, um, get it to stop on the very top, which is actually can be hard to do, because a lot of times it does not like to do that. So you can be here for quite a while. So hopefully it won't take that long to do it, you know. That would definitely be a good thing. Come on. Top, please. Of course not. Uh, yeah, we lost 10 experience, which is like nothing, pretty much. I don't even see the point of that, but whatever. Whatever. Come on, stop at the top. Hey, yeah, we, we get that 10 experience back. <laughs> whatever. Good God, man. Come on. What are you doing? Jeez, ridiculous. Oh, boy. Oh, man. Hey, we get medicine. Whatever. Treasure. Which I believe it's always medicine. I, I don't think I've ever seen anything else. So, whatever. Come on. You can do it. Oh, yay, ten more experience. 
Oh boy. Now stop at the top, please. You can do it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Is it gonna do it? Gonna... No, it's not. Oops. Hey, it took that 10 experience away. Very, very cute. Yeah, like I said, this can be time consuming, I'm telling you. It usually is, honestly. Ooh, is it gonna do it? Is it gonna do it? Oh no, we got the question mark. Well. Oh well. Get that then. That's the Dragon Seal Incense. Which heals a little HP to your entire party. It's not incredibly useful, because it doesn't really heal that much, but. Oh well. I guess it could be useful if all your characters are hurt, you know? But I usually don't even end up using it, but whatever. Okay, it just stopped on the freaking. That's just pointless. Come on, let's go. We got stuff to do. We got a sword to steal. Let's do this. Oh, come on, man. That's just even more time consuming. I thought these things were shut off anyway. Whatever. Just try and make short work of these guys. The fire. The fire doesn't really hurt these guys that much, but it hits all of them at least, so that's something, I guess. Yeah. God, I love that attack. It's freaking epic. You know what I mean? Well, a little extra experience and money never hurt anybody, I guess. Looks like, like Gremio's caught up with experience, so that's cool. Come on, let's do this now, please. Ah. I don't want more medicine. I got plenty of medicine, okay? I don't need more of it. I don't know what you're trying to do there. Oh, give, I gave up on the medicine about that. Come on, stop at the top, please. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Nice, thank you. Thank you very much. At least on the way back, we don't have to worry about doing that again. Thankfully, it just kind of flips you around, which is cool. And here we go. This must be Karinji, a remarkable piece of work. Obtained the Great Sword Karinji, nice. Cleo, let's get going. Don't be such a chicken, Gremio. We can't have the McDoll Scion getting captured as a common thief. I think we're gonna go ahead and stop here. I'll probably meet you out of here next time. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for the next episode. And, um, yeah. I will see you guys next time. Later.